Dave and Jimmy with audience participation time. I'm going to play you a bit and then you're going to tell us whether this bit is worth doing again or whether it should have been done at all. Pepsi came to us with $500 to just give and pay it forward. That was okay, but not good enough for Judge Jimmy. Judge Jimmy wanted to actually judge these tales of woe. So I'm going to play you Judge Jimmy talking to our listeners, deciding which sad story deserves $500. And then you're going to tell me whether we should ever do that again. Yeah. <clears throat> you're talking to Judge Jimmy. Why, good morning, Lori. <laughs> good morning. Tell me who you would like to give the $500 to, and I will tell you if you are in the running, young lady. All right. Well, I feel like uh, my mother deserves it. Um, she's my superwoman, and she's a survivor of uh, domestic violence, and she puts everybody pretty much above herself. Like, <laughs> you know, she doesn't do anything nice for herself, and I really feel like she could use that to treat herself and um, do something like a little vacation for herself. Well, I declare that is a touching story. And hang on here, Lori, and I will let you know. Okay. Lori, hang on. How Judge Jimmy I decides. Mean, before we go further, Lori, yes. Kelsey and I would like to <laughs> to just give our love to you. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Absolutely. Before you get judged by a morning show. And your beautiful radio. mama. Joanna, you. is this you? Yes, it is. Okay, we're not going to comment on the previous story. You're going to plead your case to Judge Jimmy just based on your own merits, so go ahead. Hi. Okay, well, hello I think there. my brother I think my brother and sister in law deserve it because they have taken in their granddaughter. Um, and my brother just found out as of January first his company will be closing and he will no longer have a job. So I think they deserve it so they can have a nice Christmas and maybe pay some bills up before they get behind. Well that is an interesting predicament there, Joanna. <laughs> oh oh judge, you wanted this. Now you gotta eat it. All right, Joanna, hang on. Hang on. Thank you. Silence in the courtroom. Oh, go ahead. Worm your way out of this one. Well, I do declare, I think we have two very fine, deserving candidates on the phone at one time. But as the legal system tells us, you must have a winner and a loser every day. You do? Maybe let me free rephrase that. <laughs> you must have a winner and a runner-up every day. There you go. Now... I can see where Lori's situation could certainly be benefited by a $500 gift card. <laughs> and I can see where Joanna's brother-in-law could certainly use the money. Her brother and her sister-in-law. Her brother, even closer <laughs> to the family. With the consequences that will be coming his way after the first of the year. I'm not laughing at either of these scenarios. <laughs> I'm laughing at this guy wanted this. So I declare... After giving this many moments of thought, back in my chamber with a nice big cigar and glass of bourbon. <laughs> <laughs> you wanted this. You asked for it. I wanted these stories. But, you. Jimmy, these Get stories you. could be really tragic. These are and tragic, you would have Dave. to judge one above the I other. I know. Oh, and my our listeners are going to go, he's an ass. Well, duh. <sighs> but anyway, after... Coming from my chamber <laughs> and giving this much thought mm -hmm. and using the great Lord above as my okay. spiritual guidance. Well, just get to it. I have decided that the $500 today will go to Joanna and her brother's impending unfortunate situation. The court has ruled. <laughs> Lori, God bless you, Lori, and your mama. But Joanna... Congratulations, you gonna be getting the green, baby. Thank you. You are welcome. Please. Oh my gosh, he will be so grateful. You guys do not know how much this is successful. Oh well, I hope they have a good holiday season. And I hope this will increase the financial predicament quite a bit in the future here. Thank, Thank you, you Joanna. Joanna, so hang, hang on, and we're gonna. You hang on to that contraption we call a telephone. <laughs> hang on. You and your kids and your technological advances. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to be straight with you. This was a trial run. 
We're going to take this recording and give it to Pepsi and see if they ever call back. I believe, I do declare, Pepsi will be pulling their advertising from your so-called radio station production thing you have. I may be barred from ever drinking their delicious soft drink ever again. That's Judge Jimmy. Mm. Now you can vote at Dave and Jimmy on Twitter. Should Judge Jimmy keep doing this? Your choices are yes, Judge Jimmy <laughs> rules, or no, period, just, period, no, period. So you don't like me having to tell someone in an unfortunate situation that they don't get the money. Is I don't really want to overthink this. Yes. The rule of law is in your hands at Twitter, at Dave and Jimmy. This is Dave and Jimmy.